Hey guys, welcome back to another review. So today we are going to be reviewing some civil regime clothes. So yeah, we're gonna be doing a clothing haul. Um, let's check them out. So today I'm pretty sure we got some jackets, some shirts, and some sweats. So let's get right into this. Um, right now, just to let you guys know what I'm wearing, this is actually civil regime. And the shorts are civil regime as well. So yeah, let's get right into this review. So let's try and review the shirts first. Get those out of the way. And we'll go with the white one. So we got some civil regime bags. Comes with a sticker and a tag. So the tags, I always like keeping the tags because they always say something on them. Um, but that's just a preference. You don't need to keep anything. Like this bag, you could throw it away. It's recyclable. Or you could use it to put more clothes in. I kind of like using them to store clothes. Clothes that I don't wear anymore. But yeah, this is a civil regime shirt. It has the rose from concrete flower right there. And uh, we'll actually tell you the name of this shirt. It's concrete oversized tee. Uh, 199X. So this is a double XT. And let's unravel it. So the front is gonna have a rose on fire. It's not super noticeable. It's more of like a, a gold type of color. And the back is going to say in big letters civil regime. Yeah, it's not it's not too crazy, it's pretty simple. Um, I like most of Civil's clothes, I like them simple. Um, personally, they do a lot of graphics on their tees, and I like graphic tees. I just don't like too much graphic. But this, I can match with anything. So let's get this on right now and see how it is. So yeah, this is how that white Civil Regime tee fits. Um, it's like an oversized tee. So it's already gonna be big if you get the size you like. I like going to a double XL because that's how I like fitting my clothes. Um, if someone someone normally might get an XL and it won't be exactly like this. So like somebody my size might get an XL, but it won't fit like this. So I recommend a double XL when it comes to making it exactly the style that I like. So that thick collar covers the neck really well. Uh, it's not too tight. It's easy to stretch and get on, on and off. Sleeves, thick. They almost go to the elbows right here. Not too high, not too long. And the shirt goes right to mid thigh. So yeah, I like that a lot. Yeah, so let's get into the other shirt. It's actually pretty much the same exact shirt. Um, this one, let's, let's see the... Concrete 199X oversized tee in black. So yeah, this is the exact same shirt, but in black. I just wanted to get something simple so that I don't wor I'm not worried about like messing it up. And I could just take it out and wear it and enjoy the day without thinking that uh this shirt could get ruined. I like plain shirts like this match with almost anything sweats shorts pants even swim trunks if you're going to the beach but yeah so we're gonna try this one on it's pretty much the same as this one but let's check it out this is the black version the black tee not much more to say from what I've already said um, if anything just these tags so they just always say something from what the the general drop was consisted of yeah and dark sports they do they like dark sport they're similar company to civil because they're all family members that own civil and dark sport and dark sport usually numbers their shirts civil not as much because they have so much um quantity and they'll honestly if you don't get these on civil regime you can get them on paxton Sometimes they actually go on sale on Paxson's website. So if you're thinking, oh, I want to get a civil regime so bad, 
but it's kind of too expensive. You can wait a minute. Civil Regime might go on sale. This shirt was on sale. And then also they have promo codes. Well, they'll do like 40% off if you follow their Instagram account and text message and email. But if you're not doing any of that other stuff, if you look at PacSun, I know they have some Civil Regime clothes right now. So go check them out. Let's get right into the next thing. And we actually got a Zippo hoodie. It's called Concrete Quarter Zip Fleece. So it's actually not a hoodie, it's a fleece. My bad. And check this out. Dang, this feels weird. Like, so it has like a texture, kind of personally cringy. Like, it's like a very like weird foamy kind of feel. Um, kind of like suede, I guess. Personally, this is gonna be really thick, I could already tell. So let's get this on and check it out. And before I do, I'm just showing you the jacket. It's pretty much exactly the shirt I'm wearing right now, except in a fleece. Yeah, so this is super soft, really, really soft. Um, it's like so soft, feels like it absorbed a lot of like sweat and stuff. Um, Cause there's like a lot of fabric. So if you got like syrup on this thing, I feel like it would get really stuck on it. I do like the zipper. Obviously the undershirt I'm wearing right now doesn't really match on what I'm wearing, but just to show that's the zipper, how it comes out to the back is like civil regime. Just like that, that last tee we we're just wearing. And then I'll just show you how it looks zipped all the way up. So this is it zipped all the way up. I mean, you could rock it zipped up if you had a good outfit, um, zipped down. Probably what I'm most likely gonna be doing. Just maybe a white tee underneath this would even match this outfit. So nothing too, too big. Kind of a pretty, uh, easy thing to match with stuff because how black it is but yeah I like this jacket a lot it's thick and it's not oversized it's not like super oversized so this is right at my waist um, if you have a shirt for it to come out to give a little bit more style um, you can but this band right here is a little long so it might come over stuff but it's not too long of a fleece to actually mix match an undershirt again the same exact fleece in another color so this color is butter so let's go ahead and see how this one is so yeah same exact texture super super soft um, I know women would really like this even putting it on like this type of sweater Definitely women would love this. Even putting this on after the gym would be kind of nice. Like it's really cold outside, you're heading to the car and you put this on, you super clean. And even a girl could rock this going to the gym or going out to dinner. Like you can make this really nice with some sneakers or make it cute with a normal shirt and some shorts. Yeah, really do like these these fleeces yeah so this is the white the butter one so it's not white as you can tell these shorts are white and this is butter so two completely different colors um yeah honestly kind of like the white one more um i wasn't gonna get the white one i got the black one first and then my girl really liked the white one so it's like i have to get it but i went off got this one and she actually got the same one so like i said these are pretty unisex you know, anybody can wear these. So, check them out. The next piece of clothing we actually got are some sweats that I got my girl. So, these are the Concrete Flare Fleece Pants in black. Go check these out. Cool, yeah, these are nice. Definitely for women, these are super cool. Uh, I like these pants and I like how this is at the top it's not super elastic so like it stretches but it's not coming towards the sweats itself so they're pretty loose 
Um, it says it has a rose right here on fire. And then down the pants, it actually says civil regime. Down the whole thing. So yeah, uh, my girl, she really likes these type of pants because at the bottom, it doesn't have a tight elastic cuff, right? It doesn't come in and like hold against the, the ankle. It's more of like flared. So she likes the flared look way more. Um, definitely the elastics at the bottom feel a little bit more like guy uh, sweats to her. So yeah, these are pretty long. Um, I know she hasn't worn these yet, but she has worn a pair of sweats like these and these are XL. They're a little long. Now, if you have any questions on the sizing, I'll try and answer it the best I can, but put it down in the comments. Um, I just gave you a small example of what she kind of wears. Um, I do have something in the comments and I could probably put it on the screen right now. And you could pause the video and read it and it explains how I prefer and would recommend the sizing for women for all pants. So let's go ahead and get to the next piece of clothing because I can't try these on. You can put these sweats on. These are the Concrete Cozy Jogger in Vintage Black. So check these out. And these are in a double XL. So yeah, these are very similar to hers, the ones that I just got her, but mine are a little bit bulkier on the thighs. And at the top, it's a little bit different. Like it's kind of the same elastic band, but it feels a little bit different. Definitely the butt doesn't have a shape. So it's a little baggy on the butt, but we're gonna check that out and see how it is once I put them on. And it's the same thing as the rose right here and civil regime down. So that's gonna be cool. We can match these. And they're two different pants. Kind of men's pants and women's pants. Yeah, so these pants are nice. Um, these joggers are definitely like thick. They're good, personally for me, I would probably sleep in these. Um, you could even wear a good outfit with these, with some nice like foam shoes, just so it's all comfy. Um, even this outfit in a sense could come together if you got some good shoes and maybe an undershirt to come out. But yeah, I really I really do feel like these sweats, you're not gonna go wrong with them if you wanna buy a pair of sweats. Um, I know they're decently pricey. They're like around $60. But for the quality you're getting, I wouldn't say that they're expensive. I would say they're almost just right at the price. As you can see, this hoodie matches the sweats that was the main reason why i got the sweats and the hoodie just to match kind of like how uh fear of god and essentials the same uh, clothing brand fear of god is essentials they have an essential line where you can mix match a jacket shorts whatever you know so i really like that Sybil did that because sometimes it's nice to wear one whole thing um, before in the past, I didn't really think that it was something that looked good, but it's kind of growing on me. So yeah, this is the whole outfit together. And that is the snap hoodie part. So there is no strings. As you can tell, there's no strings to tighten the hood to go over. And the hood itself is pretty roomy. It's not going to be too small where you can't actually use the hood. I hate when jackets do that, but maybe if you have the snap on at the same time, maybe if you're snowboarding with this jacket, that'd be cool because it could kind of keep you a little bit warm with the snap, but without the snap, it's just wider. Um, actually, the next stuff that I actually have is this jacket and these sweats, but in brown. So I actually do like brown some people don't it's not their favorite color but whoa okay so these are different so these are way different so i 
was under the assumption they're gonna be exactly like these pants. And these are exactly like the fleece. So let's read what it says. It says, concrete, cozy, jogger, and brown. Doesn't even say anything different. Dang, these are really nice. If I knew how soft this was. So that's really cool. Um, I hope the jacket is gonna be as soft as these. So we're gonna look at the jacket before I actually try these on, just so we can get the whole outfit on. Um, so the jacket just says concrete snap hoodie. So let's see if it is any different like that jacket or th those pants. No, so it's not like a fleece and it's not like that, uh, that super comfy feeling. It's more like a, just a hoodie, right? So same exact hoodie as the one I'm wearing, except just in brown. So Silver Regime snap hoodie and has the burning rose and the joggers. Surprisingly, these joggers right here aren't the same color, not the same fabric, and are a different size. So this is double XL and they fit really good. But like at my ankle area, they're super like, not short, but tight at the ankle. So like right here, it's tight have some room for my socks too that you can actually see the black ones were a little bit thicker less tight at the ankle and more like really baggy these are actually like i like the way that these are these are way more tighter slimmer and less baggy not really mentioning price difference because there wasn't not mentioning the quality it's different I would tell people that these sweats are more slimmer than baggier than the other sweats. But that's why we're here doing a review for you guys. So you guys understand exactly how Silver Jeans clothes run. Um, most of these clothes didn't have any graphics. Majority of these clothes had some plain, just basic looking clothes, but not too basic. because. The thing is, basic clothes usually aren't too high quality. These are really high quality. Just like Fear God. Fear God, it's pretty basic. Um, there's not too much on them, but they're very high quality. So when you're buying these clothes, you're paying for the quality and you're paying for the bags and everything else that comes with it, the little stickers and, and the time that they actually put into their company. We're just going to do a quick recap on all the clothes that we reviewed today. So. Today, we actually reviewed, and we're gonna go from last to first, these snap hoodies that match the sweats. Um, we reviewed the other snap hoodie in black that matches these sweats, and these women's sweats, they also kind of match. So, the butter fleece, The black fleece has this zipper, super nice zipper. And then we also have this black oversized tee and this white oversized tee. So yeah, like I said, very, uh, pretty basic with the colors, not too much graphic and something that you can really match. Pants and everything, everything went on sale. So remember, if you like these clothes, you could sometimes try and get them as fast as you want. If you have double XL, you have to get them as fast as you want. So like you have to be on it, you have to get these double XL because they sell out instantly. But if you're like a size medium, small and large, um, you're gonna have a chance to possibly get these clothes again because they'll restock and some of these clothes are on sale. If you like the video, um, subscribe and hit a like. And if you wanna keep seeing more videos, um, let me know. So put any questions down in the comments and I'll try and get back to you guys as soon as I can. Uh, thank you for watching my video, staying to the end for this review. And I hope you have a great rest of your guys' day. Thank you, appreciate it.
稼働権利。